hey y'all welcome back to my channel today i was like i am going to vlog listen every single time i vlog i promise you i have clips and i'm like i don't really like this it's not a full story i'm not doing a good job creatively and i just want to put out things that i really really like so today is march i believe march 8th march 8th yes yes I hope so. <laughs> but today's March 8th, is Saturday, and we're going to this spot in Long Island City called Blend on the Water. And it's like a Latin, like, brunch, like, restaurant. So sometimes I get tired of, like, the Brooklyn spots, and I want to try something new, and I want, like, a little road trip. So, yeah, that's exactly what Jose and I are doing. Like, we're doing, like, a like a brunch date, in a sense. Like, we still want to go out and date. Not as much as we used to, because we're saving OD. But we definitely want to, like, you know, take brunch and all that stuff so let me show you guys my outfit hopefully i can do this let me back it just a little bit all right so i have on this shirt um it's by uniglo so basically it's like a pantsuit set and i decided to um wear this chunky like link bracelet but then let me show you guys my shoes okay let me let me get the shoes let me get the shoes so I'm going to wear these um, terracotta Balenciaga inspired because I, I didn't buy, obviously, the $1,000 pair, but Balenciaga inspired mules. So I'm wearing these just for like a pop of color on the foot. Um, but yeah, the fabric of this is like kind of silky. So it's a little dressy, but I was like, yeah, it's going to be cute. But yeah, that's where we're going today. And I'm going to take you guys along. So stay tuned. Play backward, so for the backward, backward, so for backward, so for I want backward, so back, back, backward, so for the way touch him shoulder. I want all right, y'all. So we are almost at the brunch spot. I'm so happy the sun is starting to come out. It looks like it might actually be a really good day. So yeah, we trying to get our outfits vlogged too. So maybe after, because we're running late. Like, it's literally. <laughs> so it's like 1.50. And our reservation is at 1.45. So we're already late, but I called them. So hopefully after we get our outfits. And this spot is supposed to be mad good. I actually found this spot on TikTok. TikTok be having those spots. Like, I spend a lot more time. So, by the way follow me on tiktok i've been liking tiktok more like i just be dying laughing like laughing or like finding good spots or just finding good people like fashionable people to follow like it's just i love it so let's see what this spot is about once again it's called blend on the water in queens So guys, it is Sunday and we are excited because we got a new bed. So Jose is just like, you know, sweeping everything up. We actually have to move this painting. Let me go closer. Um, further up because the bed that we're getting is has a headboard. But yeah, I'm so excited because I had this bed, the old bed, since 22 and I'm about to be 30. So it's about time. We're doing so much in this room. So if it we. looks messy, we, well, Jose is doing so much in this room. But 
if it looks messy that's why um so i was talking about platforms and what like what will serve me well like right now where i am right now mentally spiritually all this other stuff um so in terms of instagram i've been spending a lot of time like you know trying to come up with a strategy and trying to stay more consistent but in the long run i was like i don't really enjoy this i feel a lot of pressure i don't feel like it's more like community built or i'm like having fun doing it um and i thought back to youtube and i was like okay i remember like filming in my mom's house like when i was younger documents and certain journeys and i felt free i didn't feel like i was restricted or in any type of way and i just feel like when it comes down to instagram i don't know what it is just the whole space is such a turn off for me like quite honestly that's just like how i've been feeling about the platform um, so I was like, I'm going to take a step back from Instagram and just become more consistent on YouTube. And I like YouTube much, much better only because I just feel like the pressure is off and I'm having fun and I enjoy it. So I, I just had to think about like my needs as a person. Um, and also I want to make sure when I'm doing things that it's coming from a place of passion and it's not coming from like, oh my gosh, I can't stand this space and I'm trying to do this and I have all this pressure and I can't it just doesn't serve me well so yeah anyway um like I said I'm excited for this bed because my old baby had well not we but I had it since I was 23 when I moved out of my mom's house so being that I'm almost 30 in like two months my 30th is coming up it's and I just wanted to, because the long goal for Jose and I is to have a house. And I was just like, I don't really want to decorate too much in here. Just because you never want to get comfortable. But I also think like if you, it, it helps me to kind of like enjoy where I am right now. Because nothing necessarily has to go to waste. Like we can sell this bed. We can give it to someone who needs it. So I'm trying to think about it in that perspective. Because I think the other perspective makes me so hasty and rushy that I just get like anxiety and I want to just go to the next level but sometimes things don't work that way like you honestly just got to be like okay um let me enjoy where I'm at let me actually sit still and you know have a little fun decorate you don't have to spend a lot you know and it's been we've been in this apartment for like 10 months so it's kind of like you got to you can enjoy it you and we're slowly so wait let me bring it back <laughs> we've been in this apartment for 10 months so we've been slowly decorating like we just got like two art pieces now we're getting the bed so it's not like we sat here and splurge or we're going to splurge it's like things here and there just to make it feel like homey you know so yeah you all right babe yeah okay i support you because like then it's not in my work, but then, and I hope that this head being as big as it is in the form, it doesn't become an issue when I'm installing it, wherever I have to install it. Oh man. I'm like looking at the thing oh. I have to see. Just vacation me at this point. I need a vacation, OD. We're trying to take a vacation in June, so I'm hoping. We just have a few more weeks to teach, because both of us are teachers, and then summer vacation, 30th birthday. So the bed is finally up and how do you feel babe? I'm tired. <laughs> yeah. 
our both of our backs are hurting from it but it's super cute i just like that we have the the headboard so if i'm up you know and it's velvet if i'm up like reading or something like that like i can just do what i gotta do and lean on the headboard my back wouldn't be hurting so yeah by the way i'm currently reading this book here the vanishing half it is bomb if you follow me on instagram you saw that i posted it i'm still reading it still didn't get done hopefully by the beginning of like next month i will be hey guys so it's a new day out in these streets <laughs> and i'm actually not working today so i really needed a day to just like Ooh, like this weekend was very eventful. So right now I'm about to do some skincare. Um, so let's get into it. Well, not night, like the afternoon, but I'm trying to get an early start on cooking. I just got back from the supermarket, so I'm going to show you guys what I got. Tonight, I'm making jerk chicken. I'm making it a different way, not usually how I make it, so I'm super excited about that. Um, some plantains and just like mixed vegetables, like that's it. Um, but I got some scallions. It smells so good. I love scallions. I got onion, uh, onions, garlic. I got some thyme, I got one onion, literally one plantain, I got some pimento seeds, um, scotch bonnet peppers, and I think that's really all I got. The rest of it, um, these are some of the seasonings that I'm going to be using for, um, the jerk chicken, not this. I meant to throw that out, and not this. I'm bugging. I'm using this, 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 um, some salt and some pepper, which I need to grab right now. All right, so I also bought this like cast iron grill. So I wanted to um, like try like kind of like grilling in the oven. So I'm excited to do this. The only thing I'm really concerned about is like the oil and the juices. I think I'm gonna place this over like something in order for it to like drip down so i can like start basting at a certain time um in my cooking so yeah
all right y'all so here is the chicken marinated i had to literally like pause the camera because i don't have enough counter space like if you look at everything one day one day but this is i'm gonna put this in the refrigerator for like an hour two hours and then let it marinate and then i'm gonna start to put it in the oven